We know they are bad for your cars yes, and are. it's peak season right now. Potholes are popping up all over Middle Tennessee and as News Channel 5's Kyle Horan found out, the effort to get them filled in is pretty urgent this year, right Kyle? Yeah, it is. And that's because if the potholes don't get filled in pretty quickly, then there might be more serious issues on the roadways in the future. Now we did follow along with the TDOT crews. They were filling potholes today on I-24. This is how they do it. All right, guys, moving on up to the next patch. Like predators on the roadway, TDOT is hunting potholes. Yes, here we go. Guys, this is the large patch we're going to have to do. While shutting down one lane of traffic, these three are fast, quickly filling in a number of potholes on I-24 near Old Hickory Boulevard. Before moving on to the next. They know what they're doing, they're good. This whole trailer is full of a patching material called a cold mix. It's just something we can use in colder weather that they, a uh, typical hot mix is uh, how it's manufactured. It takes time, it has to be a certain temperature and this cold mix we can use in, in these lower temperatures and get it to get it to stay. Greg Werdeman is district operations supervisor at TDOT. He was expecting potholes when the snow first started falling. Freeze thaw, basically the water gets, gets into the asphalt and when it freezes the water expands and Afterwards, once it thaws, it weakens the asphalt, and as the cars go over it, then you'll start seeing them pop up here and there over town. They are all over town, and not only on the minds of everyday people who avoid them, but on road departments across Middle Tennessee. We have one out right now, and we're hoping to get another one up next week. Orderman says TDOT gets some of their reports from Metro Public Works and also from callers. Actually, probably I'd say the majority of them are just folks out and about, because um, we can we can drive by an area and it's it's fine, and then two days later we get a call and there's a there's a, a, a good grouping of them like what you saw on, on uh, I-24. Groupings like this that TDOT was alerted to by people like you and I. And now TDOT actually wants you to contact them if you see a pothole that's either on a highway or a state route. You can also, if you live in the metro area, you can call Metro Public Works. They want to know about any of the potholes on the roadways as well. And if you don't live in those two areas, if you live somewhere else in Middle Tennessee, check out your local highway department. They also probably have ways to contact them to tell them about potholes. Reporting live in Nashville, Kyle Horan, News Channel 5.